complaints about ISRI and grammar seats, diagnosis by means of function test. Important. Before testing, ensure that the gauge in the instrument panel shows at least 6.5 bars of compressed air supply required for the seat. We will perform the function test on an ISRI seat. Examples of problem areas include express lowering, the damping function, and seat height adjustment. For malfunctions on ISRI seats, check for pinched lines or mechanical damage. Here we will look at a seat height adjustment malfunction. Height adjustment on ISRI seats is done via a Bowden cable. If the Bowden cable is incorrectly adjusted, the seat height cannot be changed or the seat height adjustment system moves the seat to various levels. Pull the seat height adjustment button to the end position to move the Bowden cable to the correct position for measurement. The distance between the Bowden cable retainer and nipple should be between 55 and 60 millimeters. Otherwise, readjust. Set the distance by turning the Bowden cable nut. Set the distance between 55 and 60 millimeters. Tighten the jam nut. Check again. The current measurement is now 56.31. To ensure perfect operation, make sure that the Bowden cable, lines and wires are not chafed or kinked. Now test the express lowering, seat height adjustment and damping functions for proper operation.